Dodgers placed their shortstop Corey Seager on the IL, a left hamstring injury. He had an MRI yesterday it revealed a strain between grades one and two. So it's less severe than they initially expected, but the Dodgers not given a timetable for Seager's return. I saw one reports in four to six weeks. It, it, it'll be a little bit. Uh, look, and the problem with that is Seager was starting to get it going, right? After missing last year with Tommy John, he had gotten hot, raised the average from 230 to 278. But now they're going to be without him for a little while. And with that, here's what our very own Eric Karros had to say about Seager after he went four for five with four RBI against the Giants on Saturday. This guy, and yes, I'm saying it, is the most irreplaceable Dodger. More than Bellinger. More than Bellinger. Now, Bellinger is the MVP of the National League. But in the last two weeks, Corey Seager, 18 RBIs, slugging over 700, on base over 440, absolutely crushing it. This is a man that plays short, going to bat in the middle of the lineup. Most irreplaceable right now. Well, there is no doubt that Seager is a great player. Uh, That's an interesting take, though, by E.K. E.K. was around the Dodgers a lot. You agree with him? Well, E.K. is right because it's a premier position. I think Corey Seager, being in that lineup, adds a little bit of balance. But I really think it's still Clayton Kershaw, and it's a diminished Clayton Kershaw, not the Cy Young Award Clayton Kershaw that we expect. But he brings a presence to that pitching staff, and they have followed suit. Walker Bueller is that ace in the making. And Hunjin Ryu has been excellent out of there. I think Clayton Kershaw gives them a little bit of swagger. It's mostly in that regular season because he struggled in the postseason. But I look at Clayton Kershaw as that guy. If I had to pick a position player, just eye test. I'm not talking about numbers. I think it's Justin Turner because those at-bats, when you really want to grind out at-bats and get a big RBI, big home run, Justin Turner typically comes through. I like both of your choices. I think both those guys were normal players. But right now, it starts and stops with Cody Bellinger. Bellinger has bitten amazing. This guy has just pummeled uh, National League pitching all year long. You saw when he was scrolling last year in the playoff, they're not the same team without him. Uh, this guy's a perennial MVP. It's hard to say he's not the most irreplaceable player on the Dodgers club. You know what, Frank? We just talked about uh, Bellinger. We talked about uh, Max Muncy. Uh, the, the point here is that the Dodgers have created an atmosphere where if someone goes down like Corey Seager, you can replace them. There's a lot of versatility on this roster. So really why they're so good is they can step up at any time when they sustain an injury. Last year without Seager, almost three months they went out and got Machado at the end of the year, but they did just fine going through the regular season. And plus, it's fun to bust EK's chops. Oh, it is. It is.